Hello guys, in this video I will show you how to use the PSPP to do some data transformation. Okay, in some occasion, you may find out that the data that you collected consists of some errors due to some human mistake. Okay, for instance, missing data. Okay, some data are lost, but you would like to take this sample to do some analysis work. So in such situations, you can replace the missing data with some useful or new data value for instance mean median and so on okay let's start first thing first you have to open your file okay open so open your file as a dot as every format click open so this is the this is my file that consists of a name age height and the width okay so meanwhile you have this data view okay here is the data you have uh, four variables name age height and weight weight so if you notice that i have a 30 uh, data set okay i have 30 data but somehow you will notice that i have uh, some missing data for the weight okay one two uh, three and four i miss out the data due to the human mistake when i key the data i miss out Okay, so basically you can replace. Okay, you can replace this uh, missing data with the useful data such as the mean, median, and so on. Okay, there are two methods. Yeah, there are two methods to transform the data to record the data. The first one, you can uh, directly put replace data in the same variable. The second method is you can create another variables and to store it uh, differently. Okay, you don't want to disturb the original data. Yes, can. Okay, but somehow I will show you the first method first. Okay, first go to this transform. Go to the record into same variables. Okay, so you will see the variable here. So I'm going to replace the value in weight, uh, weight uh, variable. So I click weight, click this icon. Next, you have to go to this old and new value. Okay. So you should be able to see this uh, windows. Huh? Okay. So select system missing, system or user missing. Okay, system or user missing. Okay, you can click this new value. Okay, what you want to replace the, the missing value with. Okay. So in this case, I would like to replace the missing value with the mean. Okay, so my mean value will be 62.92. Okay, 62.92. Okay, so I click add. So it means that it is going to replace any missing value with this 62.92. Okay, once okay okay once okay you have to click this continue button okay click this continue everything okay you click okay so yes you will see the difference the missing data here will be replaced by the mean value 62.92 62.92 and so on. Here is the 62.92 and 62.92. Yes, this is the first way that you can replace the missing value with the mean value. Now I will show you the second method where you can create another variable to store this missing data without disturbing the original data. Okay, so I will create a new new data first. Oh, I will open. I will reopen this. Okay, so this is my uh, same data just now. So missing value. So this is the second method. I don't want to disturb the original value. So same way, go to the transform. Record into different variables. Okay, same thing. You want to record in this variable. Wait. So you just click this. Wait. Create this error. Move into this variable box. Okay. So now. You have to give a new name. 
to the new variables you want to create the new variable to store the data right so what is the new name for your variable uh, new weight okay label label is just a note just to inform what is the purpose for this particular uh, variables okay so this is the missing uh, data for new for wait it's a note okay so done you click change okay so you click old and new value so you should be able to see this window record into different variables so same things you would like to replace the missing value system or user missing uh, with this uh, min value 62.92 okay so click add this is your first task next uh, since you have replaced the missing data with this uh, mean value how about the others the non missing value you have to copy okay so click this all others value copy so for the new column or the, for the new variable it will just copy the non missing value to the uh, new variables okay click add so this is the two command you will replace the missing data with this 62.92 whereas uh, for those non uh, missing value you will just copy okay everything done click continue so click this ok okay yes so you should be able to see your new variable here new weight so you have replaced this empty value into by this mean value mean value for the original value here which is not a uh, missing value non missing data you will just copy to the new uh, variables okay so if you go to this variable view down down here so you should be able to see the new variable is created to store the non missing uh, the missing and non missing value so we have the label here label is just a note what is the purpose for this particular variables is the missing data for the weight Okay, so that's all for this video. I will see you in the next video. Bye.